everybody it is mary and Amma. and today we are in a new location mm, <laughs> yes as you can see yes so. but we are going to get right into it today we are reviewing ready to love yes but before that we invite you guys to like and share subscribe and comment down below okay so ready to love was on last night yeah and we are going to first start off with clifton and joy our favorite yes. couple so basically what they're doing this um, episode is that they're letting... Um, they didn't like you. I mean, I, I like Joy. I'm rooting for her. But I'm not too sure about Clifton. I'm not... I know Even Clifton though has he's saying all the nice thing, I just... I don't know if he is going to... Let me just say, I'm not going to be surprised if at the reunion they're not still together. <laughs> I will not be surprised. Don't say that! I know. But anyway, so what happened? So basically the men are introducing the women to their families this episode. Mm -hmm. And Joy introduced, um, no, Clifton introduced Joy to his, I think it was his mom and his dad. I'm not no, sure. No, his aunt and his cousin. Interesting. Someone like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it wasn't mom and dad. Interesting. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if one of them has passed away or something. Yeah. But yeah. But he introduced Joy to them, and mm -hmm. they seemed like they really liked her. It seemed like she was really genuine and everything, but um, they seemed to like her, so that was a good thing. But I think what also it kind of took them off was her. that she actually traveled six months out of the year. For her work. Yes. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. that was a little bit, you know, a little bit like, ooh. Yeah. I don't think Clifton was too happy about that. Yeah. But he says he is willing to work with he her said because even he though, loves her. Yeah. Or he really... He really, really wants to make this work. Yeah. So, yeah. I think that's a good thing, you know, because I feel like sometimes you need that. You shouldn't... Sometimes I feel like it's really important to miss your partner. I think even Travis Barker you was know, saying... Yeah. Miss your partner. Yeah. It keeps the spice alive. I think so. Even Travis Barker was saying that about Courtney, that he likes the fact that we have opportunities to miss each other. We're not yeah. up under each other all the time. Yeah. You have to make somebody, you know, you don't want to be too available for someone, yeah. you know? And also, that gives Clifton an opportunity to travel, you know? Exactly. I mean, you know, get him out of his comfort zone, meet her somewhere, or she can jet in and meet you. Like you said, it keeps everything spicy. spicy. Yeah. yeah, so I think that it could work out for <sighs> them. You know, Joy seems so. very committed. Clifton, he looks like 80% committed. I'm not sure, because he was yeah. straddling the fence for a while. Yeah, And he kept on, yeah. you know, especially in I'm the beginning. Like, yeah, yeah. I don't know. But he might be all in now, so we'll see. We'll see. Um, the next one. The next po. person, Poe and Dakia. So, Poe, um, he mm -hmm. actually went on a date with Dakia before he introduced her to his family, which mm -hmm. really he only introduced her to, to her brother, to his brother. Okay. But before that, he basically wanted to talk to her, whatever, about what had happened and stuff like that. With Carmen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, basically, he did, I mean, he didn't confirm it, but he also kind of, he, he kind of sort of not confirmed it. So remember mm -hmm. when Carmen was saying that, oh, he, that, basically Poe was telling Poe, Dakia. Car Carmen asked him, what kind of women are you, what, are you looking for? Like, attracted to or whatever. Yes, and he was like, you know, he told her. And then she and asked then she says, does Dakia, Dakia do that for you? And he said, it's not your business. And you said that that's exactly what, should, that's exactly what he would have said, because, I mean, he doesn't gossip. I wasn't ever checking for posts. So I didn't yes. realize that. <laughs> and and the Kia had even said because she asked Poe something about Carmen, and she says um, she told said in the confessional, "I know he doesn't talk about women like his other connections, but yeah. she asked him this question. So even she recognized this is not what he does. He's yeah. not going to sit with any other woman and talk about another woman, which I think is stand up." And even, you know, at the, when he was hanging out with the men, I never saw him like, oh, let me talk about this other woman that I'm doing. She did this and she did that. Like, he didn't do that, except when he was asked. Where the other guys, you know, they volunteered information. Yeah. But he didn't do that. So, yes, he is a jerk. Yeah, he, you know. But it's just one of those things that he doesn't do. He's yeah. a jerk all on his own. And he wants to tell someone something, he ain't got to go gossip about you. <laughs> he'll he'll talk to, your tell you to your face. <laughs> okay, we saw how he did with Carmen as she was rubbing his head. He picked himself up, grabbed his plate, grabbed his from plate, from the kitchen, from and the walked table, away. walked away with his food to let her know I am not interested. And he told her directly, like, you know, like, like this is not going to go anywhere. He pretty much let her know this. Yeah. And that's when she went to Donovan. So for her to try to convince us now, or convince me, she's not convincing me. That all of a sudden, Paul decided now 
instead of him being direct and a jerk face, he go now be gossipy about someone behind their back. He's too old to switch up his ways. <laughs> That's the other thing, too. Yeah. You know, and I, I still, um, you know, disappointed in Carmen. Like, I, you know, it's like we all liked Carmen. And then I just didn't expect her. I mean, she's a To go I, like that. Favorite. Like, I did not expect her to kind of attack another woman like that. Oh, and then the key yeah. went for it again when she was with Poe. She said, you know, mine's is natural. Hers it was made on a surgeon's table. I was like, yeah, why? I know. <laughs> why? She, she surely did. She surely did. And even at that, Poe was just like, he didn't like, like <laughs> he didn't do that either because it's just not something he does. He doesn't want to get into way business. Yeah, catty stuff and whatever, yeah. you know? So, so I yeah. thought that was at least decent. Um, but he did introduce the Kia <laughs> to his brother or whatever, stuff like that. Yeah. And the Kia, well, it went and well, whatever. And the brother thought that she would be perfect for, for Poe. But he said it seemed like she was giving textbook answers. So and he, he wasn't, defended her. Yeah. And said, you know, well, I mean, I expect that. But she's a straight shooter, you know? Yeah. But then also the Kia said in her confessional, you know, she says the thing is, you know, everything's cool with Poe or whatever. But it's giving me friendship vibes. You haven't got, gone to a romantic place or whatever. So I don't know if we're forcing something just to force it yeah. or and or if this is something that it. has to grow over time or whatever. But she's not about forcing nothing. The thing so is, I thought that was telling. Not, I don't think the Kia doesn't want from the guys who she went for, like Eric, who's a chef. She wants somebody who's going to brighten up her life. Yeah, I think she just, she doesn't want someone who's as ambitious as her, as driven as her, even though also Poe is looking for just someone kind of, and, and together they both could find the fun, but I just but don't it, feel like it be automatic. she wanted someone totally different. Like when I look at Clifton, I look at Eric, these people are totally different from Poe. Yeah, they seem confident in themselves. They seem like they're ready to be funny, like they want to show you a good time or whatever. And something like different from up her your world. Life. Something different from, from her, her world. world. So I don't yeah. think she wasn't checking for him, and he really wasn't checking for her for her either. Yeah, he so was looking I, for something, someone younger at this. That's why I got the feeling because he went straight for Tina, and yeah. he liked Sabrina until Sabrina was like, "I'm not interested." Yeah, remember. Yeah, so I don't yeah. think really, I think they're kind of forcing something, mm -hmm. you know, but that, I thought that was interesting. Mm -hmm. Um, But who's next, Sabrina and Donovan? I mean, I think that Poe really is feeling the Kia now, and I'm sure he's kicking himself in the foot like, man, I should have made a go for her. Well, my thing, but I feel like I don't he's too think serious. that Kia is, she ain't feeling Poe like that. I feel like he's too serious. Yeah, like, if I'm dating somebody, I want somebody who's going to, like, bring some fun, some spice to my life. Yeah. Somebody who's going to be, like, randomly, like, babe, let's go mm -hmm. to the beach today or let's go out to eat or whatever. Mm -hmm. Or, like, let's go to a club and go dancing or something. Mm -hmm. I don't see Poe doing that. I really don't. Yeah. Um, so, <laughs> no shade. He might be like, hey, babe, so-and-so told me about some club, some dancing studio do you want to go to that or you what you think is she'd be like oh, i mean okay but you, she wants someone who be like this is what we're doing exactly like saying let's tell let's basically i would say yeah look get dressed i'm picking you up this time this time this time i'm not gonna tell you what we're doing but just get ready look cute and that's you know, what she wants she doesn't you know, want to someone asking her, her what she's yeah. gonna do just tell me what we're going to do but make sure it's fun you yeah. know what i'm saying so, so girl, i see fun. i know that i'm right with you boo mm -hmm. so um but let's talk about one of the most interesting couples today so donovan went with carmen you want to talk about that <laughs> okay we'll do that then we'll talk about sabrina okay. that was quite interesting so donovan went with um, um carmen to carmen to see his mom he did see sabrina before that though but we're right. going to talk about donovan and carmen get the boring stuff out the way and then we're going to talk about sabrina and donovan Donovan and Sabrina and Demetrius. Okay. We know that's what y'all here for. <laughs> but, um, so basically, after he had basically finished talking to Sabrina, he went into Carmen to officially See, go meet his, mom. meet his mom. She looked very subdued. She looked very cold. I know, was all dressed up, everything covered. I that wasn't even dressed was... up. It looked like she came from church. And yeah. I was like, oh. Probably because she's meeting the mom. I mean, but 
I mean, girl, you could have worn like not a fitted dress, but maybe like a flit and a fit and flare mm -hmm. picnic dress or something like that. Yeah. With like maybe a low, not like a low cut, but like something like this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then maybe has like some nice sleeves. But I just feel like the black and white print and then the black jacket on top, and then your hair is in a ponytail. Girl, you could have gone with a messy bun, had yeah. some really cute hoops, fitted like the jail from the block. Yeah. Like I just <laughs> thought, like, whose grandma is this? <laughs> now, what was interesting though was that Donovan said that this is the first time anyone has met his mom. And I was thinking, how about the ex-wife? Oh, and we found out, well, that was at the end. Well, we'll, we'll, you... we'll talk about that when we talk about what's happening. Yeah, I know. <laughs> okay. But, yes. So, if the Ooh. mom liked her, whatever, he she said... She actually liked her. She said, she said like, she's a gem She's a keeper. Yes. Like, you cannot let this one go or whatever, mm -hmm. stuff like that. But, you know, at the end of the day, you have to live with her or whatever, stuff like that. So, I thought that was very nice or whatever. But the thing is, I'm not really sure about their connection because Donovan really wasn't checking for Carmen. And Donovan Carmen was wasn't really checking for Donovan. For no Don and I might think it's like, don't Donovan force something. Donovan wasn't checking for Carmen at all. But Carmen doesn't want to be left with nobody. And she doesn't want to just... Well, after she made all the fuss about Tina, I guess she don't want to do the same thing and leave. See, that's why you should not be... Talking right. about people. If you don't have connections there, girl, go. Because just because you're on a TV show doesn't mean that you're going to definitely find your person. I, know. Like, I feel like Joy and Clifton, they found their person. Yeah. If Clifton acts right, mm -hmm. they're still watching me, boo. <laughs> um, but I don't know about Donovan and Carmen. I just feel like he was like this mm. in the hot tub. Yeah. And, and at just... one point, there was a flicker of disgust on his face <laughs> as he looked at her. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you cannot hide those things. Yeah, oh, I don't know. I don't know, Carmen. Girl, I do not know. I don't. I don't. You think are so. old enough. I feel like to really know if a man into you or not. But I do know that what he's. I mean, went into her room. Well, I mean, this is a any man can go into your room and knock your boots. She it, should be able to read the room to know this is. Not, not this working. guy's not feeling her and not let him come and be in your room that very day because he's not feeling you. I don't know how you missed that. Yeah. It's I mean you were right next to him. If I can see it on the television, you right next to him. You should be able to see it. Exactly. You be able to if you should be able to feel it. Anywho. Yeah. But let's but, talk about Donovan and Sabrina. He asked to meet Sabrina. Yes, Sabrina. so they could kind of talk about what happened at the brunch or whatever. Right. And like you, you said, she was giving you Karen vibes. Mm. Like she's like playing these mind games like she was the victim. Like you came for this man's whole jugular vein. Mm. And then you're saying, I don't like how he came for my character. I'm sorry, but, but you're I asked. the one who was like, I don't think Donovan, he's ready to settle down. And I don't think he's ready to settle down. down this and all this stuff, third. like, you had all the stuff to say about him. And I honestly kind of do believe Donovan when he says that, you know, Sabrina said that, mm -hmm. oh, you could be next, just like how I sent the other one home. Mm -hmm. I can totally see you're saying that. Because I the thing do. is, what I've seen with Sabrina is she loves to, like, to tell people off. Or, like, yes, to dismiss people. But she people. can't handle it. Like, she gets a little At high all. from it. Like, some yes. sick smile. Yes. I realized smile. that with her. And I don't know if it's the editing, but there were some sickly smiles, smiles. Like, at very odd times. I'm pretty sure so she I volunteered to send Troy home. I like, I'm like, yeah, sure. she has sent quite a bit. She sent Laverne home, Troy, and there was one other person she sent home. It seems as though she loves to do that because usually they have some one some, per, a they'll different take person their every time, exactly. But with, yeah. not with her. And I guess Tommy's like, Sabrina, you want to do it? Oh yeah, yeah, I'll do it. <laughs> I don't know. It's some probably some power mm. kick with her. Maybe she didn't feel powerful in her last relationship or whatever. Perhaps. Maybe I don't know what the hell yeah. going on with that with that sister. Yeah. Um, mm. But so basically, they're going back and forth or whatever stuff like that, and she basically was kind of blaming him for stuff yeah. like that. And he basically was like, you know, at this point, I'm not even interested in being here anymore whatsoever. Yeah. So he was like, you know what, I've. I, so basically, I have chosen Carmen. I have chosen Carmen, and that's Which, it. He just told her. She's like, "Why well, was she but the then, connection?" But then at the same time, too, I don't know why he wanted to meet with her. 
Uh, I thought it was weird. Because... Like, what's the point of that, though? You all have already said what she has to say. And I don't know, maybe he just wanted to meet with her to let her know, I've chosen Carmen. And, I mean, she wasn't moved by it. She was like, good for you. Right? <laughs> <laughs> and I guess that was not the reaction he expected, so... And he said that he, she was teetering between Donovan and Demetrius. Yeah. Everybody knows from the beginning she has been checking for Demetrius. Yeah. Only her and God know why. Yeah. But, like, uh, there really wasn't any competition. Like, Demetrius was yeah. it. She saw him. She's like, this is my person. Yeah. Kind of like and Michelle in The Bachelor. She <laughs> saw an ace. That was her birthday. Yeah. And so when, as Dolly continues to talk, she's like, well, you know, I mean, Demetrius has been, you know, my person. So, so I mean, it's she was not pretty like... much like, so, I mean, boo, you ain't telling me nothing that the world don't know. And so he kind of seemed like he goes, he's like, well, Carmen's my and he person. was chuckling. He's like, hmm. But well, look. I have decided to move forward with Carmen, and, she, and that was it. She, and, she like, and, I, and I do believe she said, good for you. I know. She said, good like, for you. Was, I hope it works out. Yes. And then he said, well, I'm going to go. No, no. He said, I'm going to go. They sat like this, looking at each other, and then she says, well, it looks like you want to go. And oh, he, yeah. And he was like, <laughs> yeah. And he looked dismissed like a little boy. And then he gets up, mm, mm, and she's like, he said, well, I have to get I'm out of here, too. <laughs> she was like, oh, my goodness. I said, oh, Lord, Lord, Lord. Lord. So, um, it's interesting that he attracted her again. <laughs> Before you ask what happened with the first one, I don't know. Ooh, but, people attracted some energies now. Mm. But I thought what was very interesting So then this she time, goes to meet with... Demetrius. Her Demetrius, love, her life. Right? So they're talking. And and this I was the first time. I think they had two time. dates. Yes. They had two dates. So they this go was the and first meet time, up. Right. And they were talking about her stuff like that. And she was basically like, you know, um, you know, I really want to see where this can go forward. Like you've been my strongest connection or whatever. Mm-hmm. And my parents just so happened to be in town. Yes. And you know, I would love for you to meet them. Yes. What and do then, you think? What if I were to ask you? You. What if I were to ask you to meet them? So you see, still playing those you games. Should, you should have just said... I would like for you to meet them. I'd like you to meet my parents. My parents in town want you to meet them. And she was like... So, but um, you asked her, and then she says... Um, no. We're not there yet. We're not there yet. At which I was like, shocked. Because <laughs> listen, I think he had whiplash. Because he was like... He did like, it. he needed a stiff drink <laughs> after that. <laughs> like, he was like... Oh. He's just like... <laughs> Like, no woman has ever rejected Ooh, me before. Child. Wait, and 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 uh, and and the parents, yeah, a woman doesn't want to meet the parents. parents, we're not there yet, huh? So then he said, he my goes, thing is, I want us to be solid, and this is not solid. He's like, it's, not, I thought it was solid, and then she's like, no, I was like, so then he goes to Tommy, oh, yeah, so that right? was the end of that day, and whatever, and so that. Tommy was like, mm, she said, no. Parents. And then he's like, hi. And then, and then he, he tried to explain about her and say, you know, I can see it. You know, I can see why he didn't want to look like, <laughs> he didn't want to look rejected in front of the bed, I guess. And Tommy was like, you know, I think you all need to talk again. Maybe we try to rebuild or whatever. Try to rebuild. He's like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So now he goes again. On a second date. And now This was after seems... all the men had got together or whatever, stuff like that. I don't right. think any woman went home this episode. Yes. Um, and... But he said something about a fireball or some curveball or something. I didn't hear what he said. Yeah, um, like, well, I guess that was a curveball when she said no. Yeah. But, but... But they decide to go on a second date. And he's like, you know, I want to rebuild with Sabrina. Like, I don't think it's too early. If you have to rebuild in the, <laughs> what's the honeymoon stage of a relationship, <laughs> you're doomed. You're actually doomed. Oh, ready rebuilding. <laughs> rebuilding. He said, yeah, I don't mind DBT. rebuilding. So, well, he even acted crazy because so she got goes, him all twisted. So now he goes to her and he seems determined to kind of um, convince her to somehow make this work. You know what I'm saying? And she's sitting there. <laughs> I don't want to say Okay, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say anything. She sits there waiting. She sees him coming and she waited on him. <laughs> this girl Oh Lord have mercy and she waited on him. 
as he starts, you know, to talk. And usually Demetrius, he tries to be a confident chap. But, um, <laughs> you could see in his eyeballs. <laughs> he was worried. That brother was worried. So he's like, you know, I mean, we got to, you know, rebuild and stuff like that. Work this thing out. And she was just like, well, you know. Um, like somewhere along the line, I guess it did. It, it she kind said, of "You know, I have realized that you know this." I basically, it's like she, towards she the has end, she like said, things are kind of trying to come together. Like things are not working now, late. and it seems like she said. So basically, she said, "Okay, so what happened was she basically told him the reason why I did not want to meet your parents is because what I know is with my parent, with my dad, is that whenever somebody comes to meet him, it's to the point where this guy is asking for my hand in marriage. Yes. Like this is a solid thing or whatever." And I do not want to go meet your parents and if it's not that to that level. Yes. We're nowhere close to that, whatever. Mm -hmm. And as I've gone along with this journey, I have seen that some things that are that make us really different, you see as something that is a challenge that can mm -hmm. be worked through. Mm -hmm. For me, it's a warning sign. Yes. Or like yes. it's a red flag. Yes. So I have just come to the conclusion that um, you're not my person. Right. I gotta, <laughs> I gotta listen to my gut. I gotta listen to my gut. And yeah. he was like, he literally grabbed first, his first, drink. First he said, first he he said, said, I don't feel like this is something that can, should go forward. That, that, that should continue to go forward. And I don't think he understood completely. And then that's when she says, um, first she said, I, yeah, first she said, I don't think you're my person. But then she says, you're not my person. And then he just grabbed a drink and he was like, he's like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, he, like he wanted to seem like he was so unbothered. But by the way that man tossed that drink back down his throat, Toast he was like, his what throat. the hell just happened? Put it down, blink, blink. <laughs> You know why? He like actually shrinked in his <laughs> chair. I was like, I think he's yeah. <laughs> And I am laughing at him because I'm telling you. serves you right. I remember when he was telling of Precious and all this I stuff. I know, telling all these he women just thought, all. He just thought he was whatever. So it, it felt kind of nice to have this person be like, you know. Karma came and bit him in the boo booty boom. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Now, and yeah. then, and then, as he tried to struggle to say something, when he tossed the stuff back, right, she smiled a little sickly smile. Exactly, again, like she got a kick and out then, of it. Like, then, what is wrong then, with her? And then he put, he put out the drink and tried to talk, and she goes like this after she was... <laughs> Was he said, um, so he's like, I think he said, so, I so think he said, so friends. since he said, so, um, I wish you the best. No, so he said, you know, well, the thing is, mm -hmm. my journey started and ended with you, you know, right. so this process has now come to an end for me as well, or whatever, right? So, and even then, though we don't leave together, so he said, also, he said, even though you know, because she said she was going, going to get herself out of the process now, because that, yeah, yes, so he said, you know, even though we're going separate ways, we are leaving together, and she was like. She had nothing. Silent. Just let that man drown. <laughs> <laughs> it's I'm like not... it's like when you drown in a pool full of sharks and the person's just like on the boat watching down. Look, like I'm not even gonna give you a tissue to hold on to. <laughs> I'm not giving you nothing. I'm let you, you drown, is on your own. And it's like getting it like a kick of it. Like oh, so nice to see him drowning and dying. That's nice. That's as quite he, as nice. He's grasping. Hi. <laughs> My life jacket's no, no, no. oh, it's in the trash. It's all, it's all, it's almost like she's waiting to to for him to finally on his own get you know wrestling his brain that oh it's over. She's she's not she's not saying anything else like it's it's done. So he he stumbled over they're leaving together or whatever. She's just. And then he's like, let's get out of here. He said, let me finish my shot that we can get out of here. But it looked like she was going to leave without him regardless. And then I guess they got up and did they hug? No. 
I think he just put his hand at the small of her back and she yeah, walked too. away. Mm. But you know, Chad. if her being hung up on Demetrius, if this was the outcome, I'm okay with the outcome. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I bet he will never forget her. That's for damn skipping. Mm. Next time, don't be so quick to dismiss other people. I know. Huh, he just knew I I got her, but then when he realized, oh oh no, I don't got her. I'm on quicksand. <laughs> That actually was quite funny. Yes, it but... It could have happened to a better person. I know. Demetrius. Thank mm. you for the show, Sabrina. <laughs> <laughs> Even though you're crazy as hell. <laughs> but what happens next time is... Yes, so they see the, 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 um, the girls and let um, the men... Okay, the women let the men meet their family. Okay. And it's going to be basically wrapped up. We're going to see who goes with who and who doesn't. Okay. But we find out mm-hmm. why Donovan is divorced. Ah. His weenie was all over the place. Really? Is that what he said? He he, he stepped out on his wife. Ah. And then the dad was like, how do I know that you're not going to cheat on Carmen? Ah. So, very interesting. Very interesting. Yeah. Wow. So the wife is the one who broke up the... Yeah. Wow. And he just... It hasn't only been a year and a half. It's been long. It's been three to four months. So since he, the divorce was final. Mm-hmm. And here he is again. Red flag. <laughs> <laughs> Do they have children? No. Okay. I don't think so. Mm. Clinton, but Clinton Ooh. has two kids. I didn't know that. Mm. But yes, y'all. Ooh, it is Chad. Mary. And Emma. Thank y'all for watching. We invite you guys to like. Share. Subscribe. And comment. Down below. And click that notification bell thing so you can get notified of our next post. Yes, have a good night. Bye.